Good day, everyone. Pase Baller here. We are now in this uh, January 19, 2024 NBA game day. We are now uh, talking about this Indiana Pacers versus Portland Trail Blazers matchup. And this one will happen at 10 o'clock p.m. Eastern Time. So that's going to be 11 o'clock a.m. here in Manila. And I'm just inviting everyone who have not subscribed yet to our YouTube account or YouTube channel, Pase Baller, please click on the subscribe button below. At the same time, hit on that bell logo. That way, automatically, you guys will be receiving notifications whenever new videos are uploaded. Indiana Pacers approaching this game, they got a record of 24 wins and 17 losses. While for Portland Trail Blazers, they display a record of 11 and 29. We all know that we actually provide free picks right here in our YouTube channel. But for those who would want to avail our premium picks or premium packages, you might want to reach us through Instagram, Telegram, WhatsApp, or even Messenger. Just check on the descriptions of our videos and you will see the details right there. On this particular game, um, the last uh, spread that was uh, launched was minus two. That's give uh, that's given towards Indiana Pacers. I'm trying to check for any updates, but you know there's nothing yet. So again, that's you know that's uh, for now. Let's just hold on to that. Again, it's minus two towards Indiana Pacers. Portland Trail Blazers they would have the home court advantage on this. Um, in terms of momentum, though, we got to give it to Indiana Pacers um, approaching this game. They are actually coming off a win. Um, and on their last 10 games, they have won 7 times. Now for Portland Trail Blazers, they are also coming off a win. That was against Brooklyn Nets. But for their last 10 games, they have only won 3 times. Now in terms of fatigue, it will be Portland Trail Blazers who would have the advantage because Indiana Pacers actually played last night when they went up against the Sacramento Kings. Now let's go ahead and take a look at the availability and health of both teams. Starting with Indiana Pacers, Tyrus Halliburton, pa Pascal Siakam, um, Andrew Lembard, they're all listed out for this game. Um, and we also got Isaiah Jackson and Aaron D. Smith, uh, who are tagged as um, game time decision for this particular matchup. So again, three players are, are out, a couple of players listed as game time decision. Now, if we will take a look at Portland, hold up. There are a lot of players uh, out right here. Um, Robert Williams, Moses Brown, um, Shaden Sharp, and uh, well, those are the three players confirmed out. The, uh, DA or the Andrew Ayton is now listed as probable for this particular matchup. So I gotta say that Portland Trail Blazers somehow has you know a, a slight advantage over Indiana Pacers. You know, again, um, DA is highly likely uh, playing for this, so there would basically be just three. Uh, players who would be out for Portland. All right. Um, I think uh, what's what's missing right here is the spread. You know, I, I, yes, it's minus two. That was the initial spread that was launched or that was released. But uh, right now, we don't have any updates yet. Um, I'm siding with Portland Trailblazers in here. I'm gonna just say say it straight up. You know, they are at home. They are well rested. Um, Indiana Pacers, I know they got the momentum, obviously, you know, they are the better team, you know, I will just say it bluntly, but then again, uh, they must be, you know, they, their legs must be a bit tired uh, coming up against Sacramento Kings last night, um, uh, Pascal Siakam, I, I don't think he would still be, he, 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 I don't think he would be available now for this particular matchup, uh, we ain't sure about the, the status of Halliburton yet, so again, um, whoever, whoever played last night, and whoever did well, because they did well against the Kings, uh, towards the end, you know, Sacramento Kings tried to uh, do a do a comeback, but you know, in the end, the Pacers they were able to escape that uh, that barrage that Sacramento presented. So, it, whoever whoever the players were last night would be the same players who will go up against Portland right now. And again, Portland they are well rested, they are at home, um, and again, a DA uh, should be able to assist them right now. Because uh, last time he was not able to, he, he was not able to um, uh, join the team due to some, you know, due to some problems with some snow. Um, again, just uh, for those who would want to put some money on this, maybe you guys can also wait for uh, for the, the the new spread. Because again, right now it is just a plus two for Portland. I have a feeling that um, it may actually go up, you know, a little bit. Um, and if you guys can actually wait still. Um, it, it'll be great, you know, if you can get like plus four or plus five, you know. But I'm on the side with Portland Trail Blazers in here. Um, again, I think Indiana Pacers are, are a bit tired in here. They they must be pumped up having Pascal, um, 
in, in their in their team right now. But again, we're talking about this particular game, and every once in a while, Portland Trailblazers actually um, not just like a win or two. So I think this one this one will be it. But just to make sure, you know, just to make sure, go ahead and take that plus. So again, that's Portland Trailblazers plus two. Again, that's Blazers plus two. Peace out. Pass I love. God bless.